Hi, I'm John from Chatomize and in this video I will show you how you can verify your Facebook business account so that you can use all the features of your WhatsApp business account. And it will only take us a couple of minutes, so without further ado, let's dive in. So before we can actually start with verifying our Facebook business, it's important that you have an actual registered business. If you don't have an actual registered business, it's not possible to verify your Facebook business. So once you have that, we can just go to business.facebook.com. And then here you need to select your right business account. So for now, I will go with Chatamind support and then you need to click on settings and then you need to click on business settings. And then over here, you can scroll to the bottom until you see business info. And then here you will see the information of your business and you will also see your business verification status. And, and as you can see, it's currently unverified. So when we click on view details, it will bring us to the verification for Chatamize support. And as you can see, I have a pending submission and this is because I already looked at this before this tutorial, that's why it says it's a pending submission, but I will just go through all the steps if you don't have a pending submission yet and you're just getting started with this. It's also important to know that it's also possible that you're ineligible for verification. And I will just show you that with one of my other accounts. So here I have my Chetamize demo account. And if I go to business info and I go to view details, you will see that I'm ineligible for verification. And this is when you're not using a Facebook product that needs verification. So for example, with this account, I don't have a WhatsApp account connected to it. And because of that, I don't need to verify my Facebook business. When I add a WhatsApp account to this Facebook business, I also need to verify it and then I can verify my Facebook business. So just know that if you have this situation, just add a WhatsApp account and then you can verify your Facebook business. So now I will just go back and I will click on continue and then we can click on get started. So first we need to give the country of our organization. So in my case, that's the Netherlands. And then here you need to fill in the information of your organization. So you need to fill in the name, your address, the city, uh, your website, your phone number, everything like that. And you can just click on next. And then here you need to determine how you want to verify your Facebook business. And you can do that with email, via phone call, a text message, a WhatsApp message, or domain verification. And in general, I recommend doing it via email or text message because that's the most simple way to do it. You can also do it with, for example, domain verification, but it's just a little bit harder to do. So for now, I would just go with email and then click on next. And what Facebook will do now is it will look up your business in open registers. And when they can find your business in open registers, such as the Chamber of Commerce, you will get a list of options where you can click on. In my case, Facebook can't find anything. So that's when we need to upload legal documents. So if Facebook can't find anything, we need to verify our legal name and we need to verify our address or phone number. And as you can see, if you click on this, you can see the documents that Facebook accepts. So they use the certificate of incorporation or formation, a business license or a tax or VAT registration certificate. And in general, I recommend to use documents from the Chamber of Commerce. I've done this with many clients and I found that documents of the Chamber of Commerce always work. So what you need to do is you just need to go to your Chamber of Commerce ask for those documents it will probably cost you just a couple of bucks and then you can upload these documents over here. And it's also good to know that we can use the same document for our legal name and for our address or phone number. We just need to upload it twice. So I'm going to upload these documents and I'm going to click on next. And as a last step, I need to verify my email. And if you have chosen for another method, then you need to verify your phone number or you need to verify your domain. Uh, but here I can just fill in my email. So this will be info at chatomize.com. And then I click on send email. And once I do that, I get a verification email with a verification code. I need to fill in that code over here. And then the verification process is final. And what then happens is that this will be sent to someone within Facebook and they will often take one or two business days 
to determine whether you get verified or not. Once you get verified, you will get an automatic email. And it could also be the case that you don't get verified and then you can start the process again. But that's it. That's how you can verify your Facebook business so you can use all the features for your WhatsApp business account. If you enjoyed the video, please like it and subscribe to my channel. And as always, if you have any questions on verifying your Facebook business, please leave a comment below and I will reply as soon as possible.